All right, what's going on, YouTube? Welcome back to another video here on the channel. And <laughs> no, not that crap. It is your boy Thunderbuddy29 here, back today with another video. And after my last night's live stream, I think my time has finally come when I make a video like this talking about the disastrous launch of Reboot Royale. Because I'll tell you what, the launch for this game mode, which was very exciting and looked very great has been a complete disaster so far as it's been out for almost a week now it cannot be denied that this launch has been a complete disaster now before i deep dive into this video first of all i just want to say is this is not a hate video towards creative 2.0 i do not hate creative 2.0 i do not hate this game mode in any way it looks fun and all but i just wish i could play it without this Mass amount of frustration, bugs and glitches, and so on. And second of all, I hope you enjoy the videos that you see here on the channel. And if you do enjoy this video, please smash the like button down below, subscribe, share us with your friends, and hit that bell for notifications so you'll never miss another video. You can also join the channel today for as low as $2 a month. It really helps out the channel, and it helps keep the amazing content going. And you also get access to exclusive emojis, and member shoutouts at the end of each video. Join today, link in the description below. But anyways, without further ado, let's finally start this video. And honestly, I don't even know where to begin. I mean, looking at the gameplay footage right here from one of my previous live streams, this was what it looked like. And no, I'm not making this up. I don't know why my entire map looks like a freaking checkers board or a chess board or the floor of a Denny's restaurant, as I would call it. The rendering on this was so terrible in the first days. The only things that would load in are the locations, the trees, and some of the grass as you would land in. Like, I'm not making this shit up, and I know I've had a lot of complaints, people telling me, you just need to turn off your performance mode. Even when I turned off performance mode, this is the same result that I would get. You would see that in the following stream days later. Like, it was just a big pain in the ass. And I know I've had some people complain about the same exact thing as well. Some people were having the same exact issue with, like, render and stuff. This is another issue that they did address on Twitter, along with the other stuff that I'm going to mention in just a second, which I'm going to talk about that also happened in my yesterday stream. And another thing I just want to talk about is the storm in this game mode because if you've encountered the storm or if you ever saw it it's a freaking nightmare because you'll notice how fast this storm moves like the storm is just as fast as the speed of sound it's like as fast as sonic the hedgehog like i'll even show you this clip right here that was taken from one of my latest live streams i have to back this up if you guys want Oh, what the hell? Now keep this in mind. That happened just a couple days ago. It was shortly before the problem got addressed on Twitter. But there were other videos and other people complaining about the same exact thing, except the storm was actually a lot worse than what I had dealt with. It wasn't 100% fixed at the time, and I think to this day, it is currently being looked at and being worked on. But this is what they had to say on Twitter is that they did slow down the speed of the storm, which means they are currently trying to address some of these problems that have been going on with Reboot Royale since the launch. So I actually give props to them for actually trying to fix problems and actually fix the problems that matter the most. And the next thing we're going to talk about is probably one of the worst malfunctions that ever happened into this game mode, and it was definitely the worst day for Reboot Royale since it first came out. And yesterday... It was completely unplayable, and what I mean by that, you couldn't even play it at all because the game would automatically end in less than a minute after it freaking starts. Sometimes it would even end before you touch the ground, and that's exactly what happened in my yesterday stream. All three times I have tried to join, and that's the same exact thing that happened every single time. And I will show you one clip from that same exact stream as well. The game looks fine, I guess. I don't know why. I mean, I turned off performance. I, I just landed at some random house. I don't even. I don't even know if we're even on the same team. Oh my what god. The what the fuck? 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 What the fuck?
What the? F what the fuck? What the we fuck weren't even. That? We weren't even in the game for less than a second. <laughs> what the what hell? This fucking game mode. By and that's exactly what had happened every single time you tried to play this game mode yesterday. But the real question is, are the creators of Reboot Royale 100% at fault for this? And that simple answer is no. Because yesterday they once again took to Twitter addressing this issue, stating that Reboot Royale matches are currently ending early in a draw due to a bug introduced by Epic in yesterday's V24.10 patch. We've identified the issue and quick working quickly to resolve it. And then shortly after, they posted another tweet saying, Due to the severity of the issue that causes games to end instantly, we needed to quickly strip back the original planned update. Render distance will be lowered temporarily to get this patch through and return the game to a playable state. So right there, that pretty much acknowledged the fact that they have now acknowledged that this is a more severe issue and definitely probably the biggest issue that they have faced since this game mode had first came out. But it also showed... That they are not 100% at fault for a lot of these problems that this game mode has had since it first came out. Majority of the blame is actually on Epic. Especially with all the problems that happened yesterday with its V24.10 patch which caused the games to end early. End in less than a minute. So right there, it shows you that they are not 100% at fault. And one thing I have to give them huge respect for, Reboot Royale, the people who are making it is how they are quickly trying to address these issues and quickly try to fix them as much as possible because that's how much they care about their game mode. And it's honestly, they're, and it's sad too because they're kind of embarrassing Epic because it shows that they care more about fixing problems more than Epic does at this point. So honestly, I actually give them respect for that. And once again, I don't completely hate this game mode, but I just wanted to make this video addressing some of these problems I've had with it so far. But I am pretty confident that all these issues will get sorted out in probably like a month or two. And probably then, I'll probably be saying the exact opposite that I am saying now. But I'll believe it when I see it. But what do you guys think of Reboot Royale so far? Have you had any problems with it? Let me know in the comments. I'd love to hear your thoughts. And if you enjoyed or agree with this video, please smash the like button down below, subscribe, share this with your friends, and hit that bell for notifications so you'll never miss another video. Follow me on Twitter if you want to. I love you all to death. I appreciate all the support you've been giving me. As we had now just hit 5,730 subscribers. I love you all to death and thank you all so much for watching. And please don't forget to like and subscribe for more. And until next time, I will see you all in the next video. As I am currently on my way to Chicago now. And this is Thunderbuddy29. Sign off.